Have you ever wondered if a pop star's presence in the stands could impact a football game? Well, today we're diving into the controversy surrounding Taylor Swift and her alleged influence on Kansas City Chiefs Travis Kelce's performance. In recent weeks, the NFL community has been buzzing with debates about Taylor Swift's attendance at her boyfriend Travis Kelce's games. Some claim she's a good luck charm, while others argue she's a distraction, and even ESPN's Stephen A. Smith had something to say about it. Swift's support for Kels during the Chiefs games has become a talking point, with cameras often capturing her in the stands. The attention reached new heights after the Chiefs' recent struggles, leading some to blame Swift for the team's downturn. Fox Sports analyst Skip Bayless went as far as calling her a distraction, claiming it's time to question her impact on Kels and the reigning Super Bowl champions. Even at the Golden Globes, Swift faced a distasteful joke at her and Kels's expense. Despite the criticism, ESPN's Stephen A. Smith defended Swift, emphasizing that it's not her fault the cameras focus on her. He praised Swift's successful era's tour and argued that her presence at the games might even have a positive effect on Kels's performance. However, the criticism didn't stop with Bayless, Outkick founder Clay Travis also chimed in on Twitter, suggesting that Swift might be the Chiefs' Yoko Ono. Yet, many NFL fans and Swift supporters dismissed these claims, pointing out that the team's issues lie on the field, not in the stands. As the debate rages on, the Chiefs managed to clinch the AFC West division title and secure a spot in the postseason. The question remains, does Taylor Swift truly impact Travis Kelce's game, or are these just baseless claims from critics looking for a scapegoat? That's a wrap for today's video. Don't forget to give us a thumbs up and share your thoughts in the comments below. Subscribe for more intriguing celebrity insights on Celebsplore Hub.